Hey adventurers, today we are up in Northern California. We're in the Bay Area, we're in the East Bay at the moment, but we're planning to go even further north. And I wanted to take a quick moment to stop and tell you that some of the best places to find salamanders can be your own garden at home. So this is a friend's garden here, and we started to flip some stuff, not really expecting much, and we have found so many things. Here, I've got one of them with me right here. Look at the size of this arboreal salamander. Whoa, it is so huge and it's really rambunctious too. So <laughs> we actually flipped a bunch of the logs in there. Garden, and look at just how many slender salamanders we found. We have this little, this little jar where they can stay nice and moist in the shade, but we even found one more arboreal salamander right there. And you can see that he, that one's really small. And of course, here is the big one. The just the size difference is so incredible. Um, I've never found an arboreal salamander this big. This is a full grown adult. Um, you know, if you look at our other videos, they're a lot smaller. He's just kind of pushing the other salamanders around. This is also kind of neat. You can see the variability in color. Um, so these are the California slender salamanders. You can see some of them are really dark. Some of them are gold and some of them are red and they just, they do have a lot of variability to them, which is kind of neat. And so <laughs> you can see just the different color, vason, color variations next to one another. It's a good kind of shot. Well, anyway, we don't want to keep these guys out too long. So we are going to start returning them all to their logs. <laughs> all right, we put back the slender salamanders and now we just have the two arboreals and you can see how different they are. I mean, you know, when they are just a little wee baby, they are tiny like that. You can see kind of the size of my fingernail and the big one is, you know, basically as long as my finger is with quite a large tail too. Very exciting. All right, time to put this huge arboreal back and let him enjoy the day under his rock. All right, time to put, <laughs> time to put this little guy back. This is that tiny arboreal that hopefully will grow as big as the other one. So yeah, just scooting down under there, back to his rocky home. <laughs> Whoa, look at that. One, two, three, four, four more slender salamanders. They are just everywhere in this garden. Yeah, so this is probably one of the best gardens that we have ever visited and found so much stuff at. I think we had maybe 16 slender salamanders, maybe count in the video and see if I got it wrong. And those two arboreal salamanders. Uh, my friends even tell me that sometimes they find newts here as well, and it's incredible. And you can tell, this is a busy street, like the cars are, are kind of probably, you're probably hearing the cars in the background. But anyway... The day is young. We have a lot of sea up here in Northern California. And so I'm excited to show you a couple more things that we're gonna to find today. All right, well, we just came down to this little river here, this little creek, and the water's pretty stagnant. And already I can see there's a couple newts in the water. Um, oh, here's here's one, if you can make it out up close to the, to the edge. Tatiana just spotted one. Let's see if we can get close to one of these guys. But yeah, right there, <laughs> he's swimming away. Sweet. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, sweet. That is a gorgeous looking newt. Look now. The way that we identify these newts is we look at two different things. We look at how far the yellow on the uh, from the belly goes up into the face. And so this one does come to the bottom of the eye, which is a good sign for California newt. And if we look from the top as well, I think it looks like the eyes do extend beyond that sort of outline of the head. And so this is certainly a California newt. So, <laughs> they're, uh, this is the same species that we see close to home down in Southern California in LA, but it's nice to see one up here in the Bay Area. So Tantiana's gonna 
keep looking and try to catch a couple more, but you just caught this one. Look at this. It looks a little different from the others. It's a little darker. It doesn't have some of the same features. And in fact, this is a female newt where the rest of the newts that we've been catching were males. So there's a couple ways that we can tell the difference between the males and the females. Now the coloration is a little different here, but I don't think that's always the case. One of the cool things looking at the males here is that their tails are really keeled. They're super vertical and they use that to like have some good mobility in the water where the females don't need to move around as much. The other cool thing is if you look at their hands, they kind of, the males kind of look like they have these little nails and these sort of nubules that they grow in order to get a better grip. Um, so that way they can move around again and also grip onto females better. What'd you get? Another guy to join the party. Nice. <laughs> So when newts mate, they form these little mating balls and the males will grip onto the females and you may have multiple males gripping on. And so they actually started to do that in our little container here. And this was kind of our sign that like, okay, we should actually put these guys back now. Um, we really want, don't want to disturb their mating too much. So uh, they will be going right back in the water after this. All right, well, we still got our newt friends here, but we're gonna, we're gonna let these guys swim away. But I think this is probably the last thing we're gonna see today as we make our way back uh, to home. Yes, look at those newts, they're great. <laughs> they're cute. <laughs> but please remember to like and subscribe. I'm Greg Schechter. I'm Tatiana Tuccio Schechter. And, and we'll, we'll see, see you in the, the field. field. Oh man, he's calling on you. <laughs> nice.